Welcome to part two of I Love You, Colonel Sanders, a finger licking good dating simulator. The game out uh, back here um, with a less melted mind because I took a little break between this uh, moment, uh, but still a brain that just doesn't know what the heck is coming. So let's just get right back into it, uh, right here up against the Spork Monster. Yep, you heard me say that, the Spork Monster. Um, yeah. Yeah, let's just... let's just do it. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna... I'm more afraid of those spork teeth than anything else. Turn-based fight sequence. Oh, I'm gonna defend. Trepidation. The spit hot gravy. I really hope that's crazy. I'm just gonna keep defending. Go for it. Fuck, he's just a nasty mine. Oh, oh. You kill a tensor. I'm still defending. Buff up again. I frankly a little gassy. I didn't want to go on the attack. Cook with love. Oh. Ultimate attack, rounded edge. Vile villain. Oh god. Well, I think I found my uh, thumbnail for this episode. Summoning the energy of 1,000 chickens. Pot pie power pinch. Oh god. Pot pie power pinch does 10 damage. Oh, now come here and kiss me, you, my hero. Oh, uh, I'll spare him. Left behind a special item, eh? Because of course it's a magical spell book of a golden chicken on the corner. Why would it be anything else? And of course there's a library card inside.
darkness overtakes me. Oh, the Colonel, Colonel Senpai is in my bed. Good night, my Colonel. Sprinkles is there instructing your love. And Ghost Student is there as well, of course. Why wouldn't he be? Uh, I'd rather not have a premonition of Sprinkles directing my love with Colonel Sanders. You might like Clank. Might I remind you he is a... You know what? Never mind. You do you, Miriam. You do you. You do you. Oh, great, she got drugs. He's arriving on horseback. Because of course he's arriving on horseback. Ah, uh, I must run to my Colonel Senpai.
Oh god, am I gonna die? Is the game gonna be over right now because I decided to run up to the colonel? <laughs> Another vision. The ghost. Uh, if you forget the world can end so you know it's serious. I have a feeling I'm going to wake up before he gets it out of his mouth. Oh, so the guy's name is Beetlejuice. Yep, I knew I was going to wake up before him. Uh, that's not Colonel Sanders, that's Miriam. That horse has beautiful shoes. <laughs> so sure, his horse just kicked me in the face. I'm complimenting the shoes, and oh god, what? What are you? What am I doing? Why would it not surprise me if they are summoning a demon, by the way? I've got one of those books too. also a dog. Are they going to keep reminding me that it's a dog when he's on screen? Of course you're chasing cars. Why are we getting into German now? Oh god. Give me the global history of the chicken. 
because of course we will. A chicken signed its name on the Declaration of Independence. Oh God. Take the dog biscuit. <laughs> Bites onto my cooking apron. Oh God, it's the. What is up with this evil black hole eyeball darkness fading? Oh, and the spark monster's back. Nice. The, the spark monster is going to prevent me from dying. Oh, wait, I wasn't going to die. It was just embarrassment from the... Oh, God. Toilet water. Oh, God. Cafeteria lightstone. Oh, Joy, I think they made lunch today. Competitive cook-off. This should be... I don't... I really... I'm, I'm still distracted by that pose of KFC, by the colonel there. Um, Not a sports in court. Put your knife with a chain of a heart on the end of it. Say. Keep in my 
going back into the competition. All the options for Colonel Sanders based there, so. Yeah, this is going to be... my hand in the stand mixer. I mean, now granted, I know this is a culinary school and everything, but where are they getting all these super fancy things? Uh, hmm. <gasps> Internalize the rage. I don't want to. I don't want to be over. Oh god, I have to be done soon, don't I? Fire. We should get that checked out. I'm just trying to figure out which commercial, TV commercial KFC actor should voice the character if they ever did this in the... If they would actually have done voice acting for this game. That's the only thing I can't figure out. Oh. Well, meals can be cruel. They are jackasses. <laughs> Pun! Oh. Supposedly this is true, by the way. Uh, I don't know all the facts behind it, but supposedly he actually did shoot someone. Now keep in mind, he's supposedly just, a, I don't know how old he's supposed to be in this, but they make him look like he's mid-twenties.
but I have no idea. Well, for one thing's for sure, after we made that, they made this video game, and this is bringing joy to uh, three people. Oh god, not the spork monster again. Well, you did just save me a minute ago, so... Someone vomited up. Oh, it was a golden retriever, so... Okay. So now I guess I have a pocket spork monster. Sporkymon? Oh yes, Colonel Sanders. Yes, you and me together, we can defeat anything. Ooh, he's inviting me back to his house! He's inviting me back to his house! Yes! Oh god. And you know what? You're going to find out what this is like in episode 3 of I Love You, Colonel Sanders, A Finger Licking Good Dating Simulator. Uh, we're going to end part 2 here on this nice little cliffhanger. And we'll be back with part 3 whenever I decide to pop it up on YouTube. But until then, this is the Game of Ur. Reminding you to like, share, and subscribe. And make sure you click that bell icon to get notified whenever... Oh god, I feel so horrible inside saying this. Oh god, wow, what's wrong with me? No, no, no. The Game of Earth signing off. Enjoy your games, everybody.